Hey guys, this is Krista here from Calgary Law, and I have all of my lovely Calgary Law ladies here with me today. I have Teresa Pastorell, Nicole Mayer, Jennifer Kuna, and hey. Jeff Francisco. And we wanted to come on here today and talk a little bit about how we started at Calgary and where we are now. Hello everyone, my name is Teresa Pastorell. I have been working at Caligi Law, um, I will hit my two years on April 30th. And I well, was referred by my friend Jessica, uh, and you'll hear from her in a few. I used to work with Jessica and I was looking for a new job and uh, the receptionist position was open, so she referred me and I moved from reception to workers' comp, and now I am an executive administrative assistant to Sean Callagy. And that's how I started, and that's when I started at Callagy. Uh, Jess, you wanna, you wanna take it from here? Sure. Hi guys, hi everyone, I'm Jess. Um, I started at Callagy Law almost three years ago on October 26th. I think this is the only job I've ever remembered my hire date because it's been such a big day in my life moving forward. Um, I started as a receptionist as well. And from there, I moved into our litigation department. I dabbled in a few other things, but I really helped drive the focus and the results in our litigation department. Um, Callie Law has been a tremendous a tremendous chapter in my life and I'm happy that this chapter keeps expanding and growing. It keeps giving me more and more opportunities to not only expand my work relationships, but the person who I was almost three years ago and the person I am today are tremendously different. Um, and I just can't say enough about Caligi Law and the ladies I'm sharing this video with because without them, the family aspect would not be complete. Um, that goes along with everyone else in our office. We are definitely a family. Uh, and I feel lucky enough to be able to say that with these ladies. So I'm going to jump to someone else who's in my department, who is Miss Jennifer Kunha. Hi, guys. My name is Jen. I've been at the firm for eight years. I got hired in May 25th, 2012. So I also remember the day that I got hired. Um, I started out just entering files and doing some major medical revenue recovery. And now I essentially help with trials and things like that. Um, so basically every, almost every case in litigation right now, I've either seen, know something about, heard of, done something on um, for the last eight years. Um, Sean is, amazing and gives us such a great opportunity i came with no experience and right now i feel like i definitely still have room to grow because you always do um but i definitely learned a lot and know a lot so i'm just gonna shoot it over to nicole who is amazing and sweet and lovely and she'll give you her introduction as well oh thanks jen i'm blushing <laughs> 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 So I actually remember the day I interviewed for Calgi and the day I found the job ad more than I remember my first day. I remember finding it online and thinking it was like nothing I'd ever seen or read. It was very unique, eccentric, and unorthodox. It talked about working for Iron Man and Willy Wonka. It spoke of being appreciated. It spoke of loyalty and courage, acting with insight and purpose, and of course, integrity. And I literally felt like the job was like literally written to me and for me. And I remember being so excited about it and telling like friends about it. And I'm like, there's no way this is real. You should report it to the Better Business Bureau. <laughs> 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 of course I didn't, I applied and I wrote this equally crazy response back to the job ad, but speaking about Wonder Woman and asking for a golden ticket. And there literally has been no other opportunity like this. It's literally changed my life in so many ways, and I couldn't be more thankful. I feel like I'm part of a greater good and a greater purpose, and that's 
I'm literally helping make lives better by working in them. I love that. I was originally going to start, but I wanted everybody else to go. I'm still the newest member of Calgary. Uh, Teresa actually referred me to this job and couldn't be more happier. I always tell Sean that I finally can be myself and he said, well, why wouldn't anybody let you be yourself? That's what you want to be. Um, I remember the second week I, uh, when I first started working, we had a retreat down in LBI and we were taking cold plunges in the ocean and I'm like, what is going on? Where am I working? And you know what? I love it. This is the best place to grow, the best place to develop new thinking, a thought process. Sean's formula has helped me establish a whole new mindset in six months, I think it's been now. It's been amazing. And working with everybody that is that you see here and that's in the office is just that family aspect is something that is like no other. I really cherish it. And I am in business development for the law firm and I assist all the partners. I do events. I am everywhere I need to be and I love it. It's always, every day is a new day and it's Anything else from the ladies? No. I think we all can agree that this is a place that's unlike any other. It is. And the, I, I know that I'm not just saying it for myself, but because I have such a close relationship with the ladies in this video, um, our lives have totally changed from the minute Sean Callagy gave us the opportunity to yeah. really, you know, grow and become the, the, women that we are so proud to be. Um, he just keeps giving us opportunity after opportunity and he, anything that he, it's almost like he's a mind reader because anything that we go to for him, go to him for, he ends up elaborating on, blowing up into something else, making us see the, the great inside of us um, and to really help us see our true potential. So I want to take this opportunity, and I'm sure the other ladies wanted to, to just give a big thank you to Sean Callagy. Mm -hmm. So happy to be here. I'm happy to call Callagy Law home, and uh, I'm really happy that I found my forever home here. I agree. I agree. Thank yes, <laughs> I, lo I love that. Um, I think that, and I shared it the other day on the huddle, um, that, you know, that we're really dealing with some challenging times right now in the world. Um, you know, there's people that, you know, don't have jobs and they're unsure, you know, they're stuck at home with their kids, um, unsure, you know, like what the future is looking like. And I just feel, I feel so lucky because, you know, every, you know, even though I am quarantined, I've woken up every day, I've gotten dressed, I've done something, you know, I've done something aerobic, done something physical, um, just to, you know, really keep everything moving and to, you know, just really just keep the momentum, as Sean says. And I think that without a boss, and he hates when I call him a boss, yep. <laughs> <laughs> but, um, you know, but he is, that's, you know, that's the, you don't realize it because, I mean, he's definitely more of a coach than a boss. Um, everything definitely. he says is out of love and just, um, you know, he's just really, I think what, you know, anybody who works at Calagy can agree to this, that it's rare to find a leader like Sean because he truly cares about all of his employees and truly cares, you know, what they want to do. It's not just like, okay, you applied for this job. Okay, you're going to, you know, do this forever. You know, I really didn't know where my life was heading when I got hired on, on April 30th of 2018. I did not know, you know, what it would look like. And, you know, I was 80 pounds heavier than I am now. And, you know, I was living with an ex-boyfriend of mine we, uh, in a terrible toxic uh you know, we were living in the same apartment and we were broken up for 10 months. Um, and I started working at Calgary and it finally, you know, gave me the confidence to really, you know, make important decisions for my life and my future. And I was finally excited 
you know, at 28, I thought, you know, I was getting started really late in life, but I just, you know, I was, I was excited to go to work every day because I knew there was always something amazing happening. Uh, we were, you know, just with everyone, the atmosphere around us. And, you know, he, Sean made sure that the atmosphere and the culture stayed like that. And I think it's very important that it continues to stay like that. Absolutely. So that is, uh, I think on, on this day, we are going to, I think we discussed it, you know, all of us, we don't really like to do videos, you know, every day it's stepping out of our comfort zone, but you know, I think it's important, um, to do them. And we all decided we're going to do this every Wednesday. We're going to have a women Wednesday video call. Wonder Women. Wonder Women. <laughs> Woo! And, um, you know, we're just going to, we're just going to, uh, you know, share our stories and share how we're feeling and things that come up. Mm -hmm. And uh, today, I think it was just about, you know, Caligi Law and why, you know, why we're here and, you know, everything that Sean has done. So today was a, uh, Today's just a, 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 a beginner, a, a, a beginning uh, to much a bigger appetizer, things. little appetizer, as Michael said. Yeah, a little appetizer. Just oh, appetizer. Give, him a little, give him a little something, something. A little tape. <laughs> this, is, this is what it's all about, though. Constantly pushing through our comfort zone and breaking through and just growing. Like, there's been so much growth in myself in these last couple of months. And I thank Sean for that because instead of having someone like Sean, like your boss again but your Sean's our boss coach instead of having you know doing something incorrectly he'll say you know what let's do it like this and then do it next time and you'll learn from it and you grow from it and you get better and you just get so excited each time and you do it better and better and better and better and that's how I feel like I've grown so much and I can't thank him enough for that I'm so much more confident in what I do when I started like he says I was like oh hey guys and now I'm like hey guys all right let's get this done so here I am Happy to be here. Thank you. Just happy, just happy to be here. Just happy to be here. Oh, and I love going to work. And who can say that? Not a, lot of echo. a blessing to be able to say that. Yeah. I want to echo what you guys have been saying too. I mean, I've also had jobs where I literally felt like sick thinking about going to work the night before. Oh, yes. I think a lot of people do. And like, I haven't felt that way like one day here. You know what I mean? It's amazing. I feel like we have true leadership. I feel cared about. I feel like I'm part of an actual greater good and a real purpose and meaning, you know. So. We're actually changing the world. <laughs> yeah. One warrior at a time. <laughs> <laughs> it it could be it could be Wonder Woman slash warrior. I am a women. warrior. I am a warrior. <laughs> <laughs> this is um, I I think that we should even you know what? We're going to start like stealing ideas too. So <laughs> since we're having a morning. I love you know, how close Teresa got. Like. Because I want everyone to know. I want to hear what I am saying. Yes. <laughs> Wednesdays will be run by the Wonder Women of Caligi Law. These warriors. <laughs> women Wednesday. <laughs> oh. oh, so cute. I love it. Well, I mean... This has been wonderful. Is there anybody else like that wants to share a last? I just want to say that it has been so refreshing to see other faces other than my yes. beautiful children that I'm so thankful that I'm their mother. Yeah. But it's been wonderful to hear and speak to adults. This quarantine is definitely, it's rough not for just me, but for everyone. So it, this is a great way to not only step out of our boundaries, but to uh, really push the envelope and, you know, connect the virtual to be able to keep our spirits up and um i know for me i'm a person that communication and being social is such a big deal and it really does take up a lot of my being i'm a gemini, <laughs> um, but, gemini. Uh, and the, the two weeks already has been a little rough on me but this is really let me tell you i feel refreshed i feel ready to go mm -hmm. i'm looking forward after this cold to jump back into my work to be on it level 10 and above um yes. and uh, i'm ready to go get it yeah yeah i agree 100 percent with that it's been a little challenging being home and having a baby and yeah. like trying to work and, you know, be responsive to your clients. But we definitely have such a great opportunity to work remotely. We have essentially access to everything. So our yep. clients know we are still on it. We're still moving our cases forward. We still care. We're still, 
you know, producing results and outcomes. So that's really important. Just got to get a little. Yeah. Yep. Even if it's at 11 o'clock at night. <laughs> <laughs> it works. It works. All right, ladies. Until this has been fun. Yeah, so yeah. fun. Yeah. Thank you all. We'll see everybody next week. All right. Bye. Love y'all. Bye. 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 <laughs>